Bill, Samantha, and Mark, you, you both know how much I love you dearly. Love working with you guys, but I'll tell you what, right now I want to be on one of these bikes on DuSable Lakeshore Drive, absolutely tearing up the pavement. So many people are out here having a wonderful time, and a lot of it is to benefit one very important organization. We're talking about the Active Transportation Alliance. This is Claire McDermott with the organization. Claire, thanks so much for being here this morning. Thanks for having us. We are so excited to be here at the 22nd annual 5th Third Bike the Drive. So I have to ask you, you have so much energy. How are you doing this morning? It's a lot of coffee. <laughs> uh, but no, but really seeing all these folks out here happy on two wheels it really just gives so much energy. What is, you're one of the big organizers. What is the most rewarding and satisfying part about putting this together every year? It's really seeing that we can envision a brighter future where there's more convenient, uh, more environmentally friendly ways of getting around on bikes, right? So it's you know carefree, right? There's not a car in sight. So you're really able to feel what that could feel like in real life on our streets. So I'm assuming you've done this before. What is, describe just the emotion of riding your bike on Lakeshore Drive because there must be nothing like it. Yeah, you can feel the wind in your hair. You can hear the waves off of Lake Michigan and just like that gentle uh, click clack of the, uh, the bike chains. It's really a very special moment. Of course, the views of the skylines. So obviously everyone's out here having a great time, but they're also supporting your nonprofit as well. What do you want people to know about, you know, what you guys are trying to accomplish every day? Yeah, so we're an advocacy organization. So we work with local elected officials and then um, local advocates to really help it, uh, help Chicagoland have better infrastructure for people to walk, bike, or use public transit. We really envision a community that's safer, healthier, and more environmentally friendly and sustainable for the future. I love this. I mean, this, this ride is such a perfect medium to accomplish that goal. I mean, we saw one rider who had a small little dog. What's up, everybody? Who had it? Who's that a friend? Yeah. Oh. Fan club. There yeah. you go. <laughs> Claire's fans. Uh, I and mean, you saw like a, a dog in a small basket, you know, with her owner on a bike. You see yeah. kids on their bikes. You see avid yeah. cyclists. You people, yeah. you see people coming from all walks of life for this ride. Yeah, it's one of the great things about this. This is an event for everyone. So we've got kids on training wheels, as you mentioned, up to, you know, our elderly friends that are out here having a great time, as well as adaptive riders, hand cyclists, folks that use amazing bikes to get around. And we're just so happy that everyone's having a great day so far. Awesome. Claire McDermott, so great spending time with you this morning. Thank you for all that you do. Thank you so much for having us. Absolutely. So you have until about 1030 after that they're going to start weeding people off towards the lakefront trail so you still have plenty of time to come out here and enjoy the, the ride this morning watch breaking news on youtube subscribe to abc7 chicago eyewitness news